Hidden in the heart of southern France stands one of the best preserved temples of the ancient Roman world. No, you're not in Rome, but in the city of Nîmes, home to the stunning Maison Carrie. Why did the Romans build this masterpiece here? And how has it survived for over 2,000 years? Let's find out. The Maison Carrie, which means square house in French, was built around 4 to 7 AD during the early Roman Empire under Emperor Augustus. But don't let the name fool you. It's actually a rectangular building, not a square one. The name comes from an older French term meaning well-proportioned. It was dedicated to Gaius and Lucius Caesar, Augustus' adopted sons and heirs, both of whom tragically died young. The temple stood as a symbol of Rome's power and prestige in Gaul, what is now modern-day France. The Maison Carrie is a textbook example of Etruvian architecture following the classical Roman style. A deep front porch, a high podium, and elegant Corinthian columns with ornate acanthus leaves. There are six columns across the front, known as a hexastyle facade, and 20 engaged columns around the sides and back. The whole structure sits on a raised platform, which originally had a staircase only at the front, forcing you to approach it directly, adding to its dramatic effect. Architecturally, it was heavily inspired by the Temple of Apollo in Rome, and has even influenced modern buildings, like the Virginia State Capitol, designed by Thomas Jefferson. So, why has the Maison Carey survived so well while so many Roman buildings crumbled? Simple, it was used constantly. Over the centuries, it served as a church, a town hall, a stable, and even a museum. Every time its function changed, it was maintained or renovated instead of abandoned. That continuous use is a key to its remarkable preservation. In the 19th century, major restoration efforts cleaned up early alterations, bringing it back to its Roman look. Today, the Maison Carey is a major tourist attraction and part of a city full of Roman treasures, like the Arena of Nymphs, a Roman amphitheater still used for concerts and events. In 2023, the Maison Carey was finally added to the UNESCO World Heritage List, a well-deserved honor for a building that bridges two millennia of history. So next time you think of ancient Rome, don't just look to Italy. The echoes of the empire live on in places like Nîmes, and the Maison Carey is a stunning reminder of Rome's reach and its enduring beauty. Like this journey through time, subscribe for more ancient wonders every week. Like and subscribe.